Good morning from day two of Fort Wilderness. Big, big news. What? I changed the color of the fireplace to blue. Oh. <laughs> Look at that. Look at us now. Oh, also, you probably have already seen this, but I'm wearing my spirit jersey from our cruise, from our Halloween on the High Seas cruise. Oh. And you know what I was thinking about? I feel like we went from run one cruise to another. This feels like a cruise cabin. Yeah, because it's like tight quarters and yeah, stuff like that. Yeah, like the bathroom especially feels like we're on a cruise. Yeah. It's very interesting. And like we said last night, the way that it moves, you feel like you're on the cruise. Yeah. Yeah, so it's like uh, a land cruise. Land cruise? Yeah. Ooh, so we've done now three different kinds of cruises. We've done a sea cruise, we've done a land cruise, and we've done a star cruise. It's true. Ooh. I know, it's kind of like too soon though, because that's... Over. Just closed. Yeah. Pretty but recently. But today, we're gonna go get on the golf cart, explore, take a little look, a little looky loo. Yeah. See what we can see. Maybe get some food. Oh yeah, I want to go to the Hitchin Post. What's or like, that? Or like, I don't know where the provisions are. Oh yeah, I want to see. I want to see the merch. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Oh okay. Same, Gift shop. Same place. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> okay. Also, did want to mention that Jackson is currently at school right now. We will go pick him up, and uh, he'll be here towards the latter part of the video. Yeah, so we're still, we're close enough to home that we're still like living our normal life. Yeah. So he's still at school. He is very excited to do 40 things. Not the number 40, but like fort E. Oh, 40. Yeah. Like Fort-esque. Yeah, when we get back, when he gets back from school. Gotcha, so. I was like, what is what 40 things is he going to do? I was very confused about that one. Maybe he will do 40 things. Maybe oh, yeah. he'll explore. Maybe he'll hang out with Maybe friends. He's definitely going to make some memories. <laughs> he might not nap often. That's a thing that might not happen. I'd like to do that. Right? It'd I feel nice. like we need to buy this sign now. Right? It's inter it's like ingrained in our lives. Right? But let's go get on the golf cart. Let's do it. Did want to point out that because this golf cart has seatbelts in it, we were able to put the car seat in. No problem. Yeah. Look but at that. like we said in yesterday's video, we did have the ratchet straps in our previous golf cart extravaganza with Jackson when he was in the car seat. So even if it doesn't have a car a uh, uh, a seat belt you should bring like straps so you can strap them down yeah man i was looking for inflatables before we left and they're just like they were so expensive like because the disney ones especially are like 80 dollars. here's my question anybody that's watching this that has an rv what kind of rv do you have because like every time that we come i get the bug like i want an rv but i wouldn't even know where to begin i got the fever and the only prescription is to buy an rv what do you think oliver you like it? This is the essence of the fort right here. Tight. You got it. I believe in you. We can come up here and have like a bigger picnic. Yeah. Oh, and there's another playground right there. Oh, this is nice. This is the pool. Nobody's in the pool today. It's so cold. There's people in the pool? Yeah. What are you guys doing? Oh, there's they shuffleboard. Oh, they, they're mining for gold. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's archery right here. This is where the campfire sing-along is? Ooh. Oh, this is where the movie is. Look at the size of this movie screen. This seems like it would be a lot of fun to come to. This is where the campfire is and there's a movie screen. See, so yeah, we're trying to get over to there. How do we get over there? Oh, they have, uh, what's this called? Cornhole. Is it a Halloween one? It is 31 days of Halloween. Oh, is it? It's like the free form. All right, so the building that we're trying to get to, I think the entrance is from a different road. I don't know if there's a way to get to her on a cart from this way. There is. We just we needed to go back out to the main road. Like we were by the pool, which is on this road. Right. Like those loops. And then we needed to go back out to the main road, make a left, and go down this road to these loops. That's what I was saying is I don't think there's a way to get into it like through the center riding no, a golf yeah, cart. Yeah, I think you have to like go out to the road. Gotcha. Yeah. But now we know. You smell the horses. I think that's just me. No. <laughs> They're not. That's I just I got the camping aura about me. Is that what it is? Yeah. It's worked out better because when we were driving, we couldn't see this. We have the campfire schedule. What's today? So it says Tuesday's Hocus Pocus. Ooh. Tomorrow what is Emperor's New Groove. 7.30 to 9.30. So the only thing No, the movie starts at 8.40. Whoa. Oh, okay. Pretty that's, late. The only thing about it is that Jackson's bedtime is still so early. I know. We're just like not quite there yet. Right? Oh, Dang. there's somebody coming. We gotta move out of the way. So we're headed to the Meadow Trading Post, which is just past the bike barn. And we came in at the Meadow Swimming Pool and Tennis Courts entrance. Also- I can't get over how beautiful it is right now. It's very nice out. The weather is perfect. 
We should canoe. Why canoe when you can take an elevator? Oh, where'd she go? Oh, there she is. <laughs> yeah. I feel like you used to be able to canoe all over Fort Wilderness, but I think you're only allowed in this section now. I don't know, because I haven't seen anybody canoeing. But you can rent bikes, you can rent canoes, all kinds of different stuff. Ooh, Halloween activities. Oh, this is not until the end of October. Month long, they've got the puzzle hunt in the bike barn. And then sign up for golf cart extravaganza. Sign-ups start on October 22nd, but the actual golf cart extravaganza is the 30th. We came to the one for halfway to Halloween. We'll put a link to that down below the like button. Pumpkin decorating contest? Halloween beach bash? Wow, sounds like a lot of fun. And then camp or treat on actual Halloween. Ooh. Wow, that's so much fun, a lot of stuff. There's gonna be a pet parade. Oh. You can rent a, a locker for a dollar. Here's all the different prices. You can do some mining for 1050. Oh, you got different different levels of it. All the way up to $33. Rent a canoe or rent a kayak for $8.50 for 30 minutes or a canoe for $8.50. Bicycle is $11 for an hour or $20 for the day. Casting rod and fishing gear for $10 for 30 minutes or $16 for the day. And then they also sell worms or wigglers or night crawlers right there. Fireworks cruise, that is available at various resorts. Uh, starting at $449. We've done that before. We'll put a link to that in the description down below. We've done bass fishing before. We'll put a link to that in the description down below. We haven't done this. This is something that I want to do. A Segway tour through Fort Wilderness. And then archery. I'd like to do archery. Sounds like fun. And this is the gem mining experience where you buy a bag of dirt and then you use this water to try to sift off the dirt and find out what gems you got. A childhood memory from one of these places we went to in Virginia. I think it was called Rock City. Is oh, okay. that a place? Yeah, Sea Rock City. I, that's like my, I, I can picture like a bird. Like their logo is like a bird. Their logo is a bird house. I just remember like a, like a, like a woodpecker or some kind okay, of, you maybe. know what I mean? But that's, it was like Rock City. You could see the four states. And there was something else. There was another, but that's like a core memory. I mean, okay. we did this there. So I want to do this with Jackson. I want him to have like these memories when he grows up and he'll go, I remember one time. <laughs> yeah, right? There was a bird. <laughs> and Jen just asked me what kind of rocks you can get. And Jen, these are not rocks. They're minerals, Marie. You can get some calcite. Ooh, topaz. Wow. Or you could get fossils. That's fun. Oh man, we need to make a trip out here when it's warmer so that Jackson can play in this splash pad. This splash pad looks like so much fun. Wow, look at it. This is at the Meadow Pool because we're going to the Meadow Trading Post. So this is the Meadow Trading Post. And there is another gift shop out there by where we got the food last night, but I feel like this one's just better in my opinion. More of a selection. Oh, look. But if you use the fuel rods, this is where you could switch them out, right here. I forgot about fuel rods. Yeah, Nick always tells me you can get them for like very cheap on Amazon. Fuel rods? Yeah, like and then fully... just, yeah, and then switch them out here. Oh, that's There's a dog inside of the gift shop. Oh. Just like hanging out. But I wanted to also say, I think we'll check out the There's other two gift dogs. Shop. This is a gift shop for dogs? What is happening? <laughs> but we'll check out the other gift shop so you can see the difference. Ah, we're here for Humphrey's Remedies, because I've got worms. Oh, that's it. It's just witch hazel. Use witch hazel if you've got the dropsy. I don't understand. Is it just everything? Oh no, each one is different. This is just like, they don't tell you what it is. There's like, these are our remedies for the dropsy. And scanty secretions. This is kind of, what is nervous prostration? And why is it so expensive, the remedy for it? Jen told me there was cute stuff in here. Yeah, come look. Okay. Firewood, oh my goodness gracious. Look at how expensive the firewood is here. We got it at Publix for $8, but the company that we rented the RV from said they would get it to us for $7. What'd you find? Okay, so first of oh, all- Oh, going camping at my home away from home. I love that. We got this this shirt here for 30 bucks, but we got a new list of things to do. Oh, have a hand clapping, foot stomping, sing along, singing, movie watching, trail riding, s'more making, canoe rowing, bike riding, campfire watching, good times. <laughs> I like this. Chip and Dale. Oh yeah, I think it's kind of just like a display piece. Yeah. 
But it's cool. if you like this, uh, you're gonna love this. Oh, okay. Oh, like what's this? this? Is... is this like a denim shirt? Fort Wilderness? Ooh, look at this. Back in the day, my grandma used to buy all of these from Disney. Okay. So she has like all these really cool denim Disney shirts from like the 80s and early 90s. And I, I wish, I wish that I had that collection. Right? But this is kind of like that. It's reminiscent of it's that. It's a lot softer than I thought it was going to be too. Yeah. It's cool. I like it. Oh, photo frame. It's perfect. Yeah. I kind of want to get this. Yeah, yeah. This one is 30 bucks. Oh man. Look, and you can get a matching shirt here. I'd rather be canoeing. For $27. It's, the denim shirt's 50 bucks. Or 60 oh. bucks. Oh. Yeah, I want to get this for Jackson. He's never been canoeing. Well. But he'd rather do it. <laughs> than anything. <laughs> this is so cute. <laughs> Look at Chip and Dale. Oh, their shoulder. That's like a shoulder pet thing. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. You can put them both on your shoulder. Let's see. Can you put it? Oh, you can put them on opposite shoulders? Can you? I think so. One can be like the devil and one's the angel. Yeah, right? Is there two? Is there two pads in there? No. Oh Look yeah, there are. Yeah, two different shoulders. Which side's Chip and which side's Dale? I would say that Chip is probably. I know the red nose would lead you the other way, but I think Chip would be the devil and Dale would be the angel. Hmm. Okay. No. I'm I'm kind of agreeing with you on that <laughs> one. Ooh, the same design on like a thicker canvas shirt. So this is yeah, this is like Ooh, a jacket. Look at this. Isn't that cool? Wow. I love Try it. Circle D Ranch. This one's cool. Fishing, fishing on at the, the fort. fort. It's got all your pockets. Yeah, you can put all your like fishing lures in there. This is neat. And like maybe like a few acorns to feed the squirrels or the chipmunks. <laughs> Look at you guys with your lounge flies. You got nothing on me. I'm gonna get this backpack. This is a lounge fly. It's a lounge fly. Yeah, that's. What I was gonna show you oh, this wow. too. Look at that, and then look at I like, a little like mushroom on this. It's like a log that the cup is. Chip and Dale living inside, living their best life. So this one is eighty-eight dollars for the backpack. Eighty-eight. That's a typical lounge yeah. fly, but it's bigger yeah, look. than a normal lounge fly. Right. That's nice. I love that. I kind of want to get this for Jackson for like his backpack for school. Oh yeah. Right. That's good stuff. I love it. It's pretty cool. How much was the shirt? Oh, it didn't have a price. Oh. I don't know. None of them have. To be determined. All right, Tim's got on the cool jacket. We think this may be a ladies' jacket, but it is we're not totally the sure. The buttons and the zipper are like backwards, and I don't know why that is, but like, ladies' cut is the zipper zips opposite of men's, oh, and like okay. the buttons bu button opposite. Oh, well, I think it looks really cool. Turn around, let me see the back. Yeah, look at you. We did find out this is eighty dollars. <laughs> this is like fun because they can turtle neck it. Like, are you, I think you're too turtly for the turtle club, though. <laughs> you look like you're going to like a show like you know what i mean yeah yeah i think it looks awesome oh the meadow swimming pool this is sort of where we're at right now pioneer hall that's where hoopty doo is tri circle d ranch where you can ride the horses and this is the new because they've redone the tri circle d oh, ranch yeah. so this is like the updated version fort wilderness campground established 1971 and the reception outpost that's where you check in but this is so neat it's very nice oh and it's got like extra loops here so that you could put like carabiner on there or something yeah this is for because you're you're like hiking yeah, at the fort <laughs> you're doing some hiking with mickey um, yeah i love it well it's got a barrel full of hiking sticks Ooh, amazing yes. you pick your perfect one it's got little jingle bells on it oh, keeps yeah. the grizzly bears away oh and it's got like a little pad on the bottom of it it doesn't sense. have the price on it you got a whole section of halloween stuff this is all nothing specific to the fort but it is all Halloween items. Oh, wait, I didn't show what? you this. There's one more. Is there a Halloween thing? No. Oh, well, there's specific Fort Wilderness ears. Oh. Isn't that fun? These are $45. What's on the back? Oh, Fort Wilderness Campground. They're they, kind of they're, like heavy. They're big. Yeah, they're very like, these this are hefty. Yeah, Oliver's like, what are you doing right now? <laughs> yeah, they would definitely like topple off because they're pretty like top heavy, but they look so cool, right? Yeah. Oh, wait, there was a backside to that sign. What sign? I don't know. The sign that was the Fort Wilderness. I must, my home, staying at my other home sign. Oh, Camp Sweet Camp. It's actually a Christmas sign. So let me see the front of it again. See? There you go. Two signs for, for the price of one. Right? Look at these Christmas ornaments. They have Pioneer Hall. They have the reception outpost. And they have Mickey with an old school RV. Oh, that's fun. They also have Chip and Dale ears, too. Look at those. Just with Chip and Dale on the top. You're not a true Fort fan unless you're wearing Chip and Dale Fort Wilderness socks. Oliver's trying to pick out his Christmas presents right now. He's yeah. like, what's that? I like this. There's like a whole bunch of different sports balls. 
And then this is neat because it's got like backgammon, it's got checkers, it's got chess, it's got dominoes. Um, I don't know what this is. Some dice game. It's got cards. Pretty neat. It says it's five games. Wait. It includes everything you need to make three space aliens. It's a crochet kit. What is in here? It's like I thought there'd be a picture of it on the back. What all is involved? But this is 36 pieces. You're not buying the aliens. You have to make them. Oh, it's okay. But it's a kit to make the aliens. Oh. Isn't that neat? How much is this? 20 bucks. That's not bad. You see how sad the little baby was that he can't play with this crochet kit? Oh, no. So the rest of the gift shop is really just like park merch that you can get in any of the parks. They have some ears. They have a whole thing of hats. The green and blue collection over here. And then just the like you know, everyday park merch with some cool sweatshirts and some lounge flies. You can get your flip flops. The only like fort specific stuff is the stuff that we showed you. And then they also have the Disney 100 merch. They have and the bear stuff too. Yeah, a ton of Smokey the Bear stuff, which we also saw, I think at Fort Wilderness or Real Wilderness quick. Lodge. This is something that's um, always fun is the, is the spare tire cover. I wish we had a car that had one of these. I would love that, 80 bucks. Jackson wanted to decorate the golf cart. And look, they sell, these are Christmas lights, but they do sell lights in right. this gift shop. How much are they? $35. Mm, look at this fun stuff over here too. You can get a Dole Whip little like container, a churro container, a poison apple container, and just some candles. These, will, these wouldn't work on the golf cart though because you have to plug them in to oh. 120 outlets. So. Okay. There's also a bunch of different food items. Oh, Mickey's pumpkin spice. Look at that. Look out, Starbucks. <laughs> Coming for you. You can get baby food, Pedialyte. Good thing to know that it's here because in the summer, a lot of people are going to be dehydrated. You can get all kinds of baby food here. Anything that you might need. Well, I wanted to also mention that the baby food is not... They only have things for... Um, oh, okay, these are second sitter. I was going to say these are 12 month and up, so like we wouldn't be able to use those for Oliver. Right. So make sure you do bring your food just in case. Yeah. But in a pinch, they have a yeah. few options. So we, we showed you guys that there is like fishing poles that you can rent and you can go anywhere at the fort to go fishing. It is catch and release, but this is a specific dock to go fishing off of right here. And then Jen, did you see what you're standing on? I did. Hopscotch. Oh no, I gotta do it. Oh. You know how to do it? No, you need a sticker, or something like a rock. There's a stick right there. You gotta throw it. Oh, it's on number nine already. Yeah. Don't you like throw it? Oh, there's one on number five also. Yeah, oh, so you no. throw it, right? You gotta clear this one off number five so there's no confusion. No, you can have more than one. Oh, no. You but gotta right, do... you throw it, you get it on one. Okay, and then you, you gotta skip, skip that, that one. one. These are big. Aren't you just supposed oh, no. to... Oh, no, you kicked it. Aren't you just supposed to do like one foot? I did. I did you went like this, you went like... Boop, oh, no. boop. <laughs> You're like doing moonwalk. Like That was uh, That's the hack. That's the hopscotch hack. We should do a TikTok that's all ha hopscotch hacks. <laughs> that's hard to say. Ooh, look at this picnic table underneath this giant oak tree over here. Oh, that's the place. That's where it's at. That's where we, yeah. So let's go grab some lunch, actually. We're okay. not going to eat there, but we should. Yeah, maybe we'll eat out by the beach. Passing back by the meadow pool, heading back to our cart. There are also a couple of, or three, about three picnic benches out here. And there's some extra large checkers, too. We stopped off at the meadow pool to go to the bathroom, but they also have a snack bar here. You can get beers and stuff like that. But then you can also get carrots and celery sticks. Yes. Tortilla chips, Mickey pretzel. Okay. Oh, you can get entrees. A turkey sandwich, grilled chicken wrap, roasted veggie, sa roasted veggie sandwich, a hot dog, garden salad, bears in dirt. Ooh. And then the kids have an Uncrustable or a turkey sandwich. There's also an arcade here, too. There's also a ping pong table over here. There's a Coke machine. There's a Coke freestyle thing behind me. It's not a freestyle. It's like, what do you call It's just like a fountain, but you need to have the RFID on your cup to use it. Uh, and there's also billiards, like somebody's playing billiards right there. There's also bike racks everywhere because biking is the way, another way, another popular way to get around if you don't have a golf cart. One of the things that's great about this golf cart is that it came with a Bluetooth speaker. So we're listening to Halloween music as we're driving around. We came up, we're gonna get some lunch here in just a second, but we were looking at everybody's golf cart decorations. Look, this one's got a cocoa. It's got the guitar on top and everything. Wow. I like your golf cart, it's awesome. This one's got a spider on top of it. Oh no. I think we're gonna end up ordering some stuff from Amazon and just like putting it on our golf cart while we're here. So when you're in a golf cart, you can go some places that like cars can't go. Like this little tiny walkway here is a cart path. I shouldn't say it's a walkway, it's a cart path. It's not a walkway. But I, one of my favorite things is 
some of the things that have happened from golf carts trying to squeeze past each other. I wonder if when they built this, golf carts were smaller. Because look at this pine tree coming up over here. Do you see how it's like, yeah, right here. Do you see how it's like carved out on one side? Oh. From people just kind of like gently going past it. Also, I want this giant oogie boogie. Oh yeah. Look at this thing. Look you know at how many Jack Skellingtons they have. All right, so we came back to the RV for some <laughs> lunch. <laughs> Little buddy's gonna eat some lunch. What you eating today, Oliver? What are we having? We're having some pear, kiwi, spinach, and pea. Look at his face. <gasps> Hi, buddy. Did you like it? This is the first time trying it. Watch his face. Baby review. Baby review. Just with emotions. I think we like it. Yeah, he's. I think he's okay with it. Here you go. Over here. You like it. <laughs> he likes it. There's also a tow mater golf cart look at this you think somebody sells like these front ends like this or do you think they made it every time we're here we see one of these so i feel like he can't be the only one right right what if he is what if he just like lives here he's the only one it looks awesome right jackson would love this right i like how the mirrors are two different heights that's fun <laughs> but we're going to trails end but there's also crockett's tavern here where you can get beer wine and cocktails like all of these up here well those are some good ones yeah and they have front porch sipping cocktails. Oh, they have some zero proof cocktails. So the last time we were here, we got some really good appetizers from this window, but I don't think they serve them anymore. I know, they had like they jalapeno poppers. They had uh, fried green tomatoes. And now they don't have them. So hmm. let's go see what's in Trails End. Here's what we got. I got some, some water, some barbecue rice trips, a brisket sandwich. And I got, this is my favorite type of brownie. It is about $7 for this brownie though. So be warned. It is delicious, but very expensive. Jen got a pulled pork sandwich that we're waiting on. I'm gonna open this up and have a look in the inside of it. Ooh, yeah, there's the inside of the brisket sandwich. Some cheese and some lettuce in the middle, some brisket, and then some horseradish sauce. Interesting, I'm gonna put some barbecue sauce on there too. I already had a bite of the brisket. It's super smoky. It tastes like a campfire. So because I forgot to show the inside of mine last night, let's see the inside of this pulled pork sandwich. I wish it had more slaw, Yeah. but it looks pretty good. I, um, I wish that they had more options also. So I think we're gonna, maybe tomorrow, We'll eat lunch outside of the resort. Yeah. Because there's just not a lot to choose from here. Like over at McDonald's. No, we're oh. going <laughs> to I mean, there's nothing wrong with that, but we're going to do something like Disney, you know. Disney Springs is right up the street. Port Orleans is right next door. Here's something that's interesting. Well, number one, we're by Pioneer Hall, so there's some like jamming music happening out here. Mm -hmm. Your sandwich was $10.79, and that includes french fries. Uh -huh. My sandwich was $10.29 and did not include french fries. Mm -hmm. Yours was made hot and fresh. Mine was out of a refrigerator. I feel like you got the way better deal. I mean, yours looks really good though. It's bigger a little yeah. bit too. Yeah, yeah. You got the french fries. Mm. So Jackson really wanted to decorate the golf cart, so we went to Publix real quick and we got some <laughs> lights. Where Ooh, do you think they, they should go, Jackson? Oh, what, yeah, what are the lights? Googly eyes. Googly, googly eyes. eyes. Where should they go? Should they go on the front bumper? Oh, fun. yeah, that'd be yeah? kind of fun. You think yeah. that's a good spot for them, like yeah. right here? Should oh. they hang down or should they be wrapped around this? They should be, let me show you. Oh, okay. yeah, show us, show us. Tied around here. Okay, you see this switch right there? On the yeah. count of three, you're going to flip that switch. You ready? One, two, three. Yay! Buddy, look. Ooh. Look up at the top. We got orange lights, too. There's orange. Look underneath. Look underneath. Is there lights underneath too? Yeah. Whoa. Oh my goodness, Jackson. Your golf cart is so decorated for Halloween. I love it. Wow. <laughs> Look at that. So exciting. We did it. It's got eyeballs and it's got orange lights. That's pretty neat, bud. Yeah, you yeah. did it, buddy. Good job. You're in the spirit of Halloween. I'm in Halloween. All right, so we're back in the golf cart. You guys may notice that I am wearing a Halloween outfit. That is because I am going into Not So Scary tonight, whereas Jen and Jackson are gonna go looping. They're gonna go out and explore the fort, hang out, look at some of the decorations. They've got their, their lights on. I'm gonna put some music on for them so that they can like jam out, let everybody know that they're here for Halloween. And then I'm gonna head into the park.
All right, so we just went down to Trails End, which is right behind me here. And we just honestly, we grabbed some pizza. It was just like the easiest thing to do. The baby's here, we're at the playground. Big brother is gonna go play on the playground. Yeah, he is. Is that so fun? Do you love that? Yeah? So big brother's gonna go play on the playground. I think I'm gonna walk around with you for a little bit. Um, we're gonna eat some pizza. I just found, I snagged a table, which was just lucky. And then, Tim is gonna be at the party, so you're just gonna kinda hang out with us for the rest of the night. And that's what we're gonna do, right bud? Hi babes. You look very cozy. Okay, I went and I grabbed our pizza. I'm just sitting over here at our little table at the playground. Let me show you what the pizza looks like. It doesn't look like the best pizza. It's not the best pizza I've ever seen in my life, but you know, it's easy, it'll do. It says, oh boy, pizza's here. Something smells good. So there it is. I don't know, it doesn't even look super cooked. That's okay, we'll make this work. <laughs> so now we are all done eating. It's dark now, it's like completely dark. I don't know if you can see behind me. Oh, Oliver's ready to go. He's, <laughs> um, so Oliver ate, we ate, Jackson ate, we're full. We're, our bellies are full, we're ready to go look at some Halloween decorations. We're gonna go looping. You ready to go looping? What looping? That's when we go around in the golf cart and we look at everybody's Halloween decorations. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so we're gonna go do that. And then um, we'll show you guys a little bit of that too. But we're gonna do a lot of looping tomorrow night and Thursday night. So just be prepared to see to see so many Halloween decorations. So we're just leaving the playground. There is um, the horse and carriage over here. You can do the horse and carriage rides. We did that the last time we were here. And it was so much fun. I'll link that video down below. But look at the sunset. There's no, there's not even sunset. Yeah, well, it's way over there, buddy. And the thing that I love most about this resort is how pretty it is. Don't you think it's so pretty? Yeah. I do too. Yeah, I asked Jackson. Dragon. Oh, there's a dragon on top of their golf cart. Look at that. But I was asking Jackson what his favorite Disney hotel was. And what did you say? What was your favorite Disney? Fort Wilderness. He said it was this one. It was Fort Wilderness. I go on this side. Oh. Whoa. I agree, it's in the it's in like the top three for me too. Okay, so we made it back to the campsite. We grabbed a blanket, we put on our jackets, but I, I don't know if you guys can see actually. I know you can't really see, but we're gonna go check out some of these cool decorations that I'll you see. I'll tell you where to go. You'll tell me where to go? Yeah. Okay, all right, you're my navigator. And then we got the baby is all snuggled up and cozy, a little snuggy buggy and a ruggy. We're gonna put his hat on. <laughs> Was that funny? Are you a snuggy buggy and a ruggy? Is that so funny? So yeah, uh, we're we're all ready to, to me. It was funny to you? Yeah. Alright, we're all good to go. Um, Everybody has hello. the the Bucky's like squirrel guy. Ooh, it's kind of spooky Turn out here because there's not a lot of light. Bit. Turn a little bit? Yeah. Okay. And got my my GPS navigation system over here. So make sure you don't bam into that car. Oh, I won't bam into any cars, don't you worry. I don't see any, oh wait, I'm coming up on one. Look at all these decorations. Ooh. Look at those ghosts. <laughs> Happy, Happy Halloween. Halloween. Happy Halloween. Oh, that was, Happy Halloween! That was so fun, buddy. All right, what do we see over here? We're gonna pass by these guys. Ah, uh, those are tw that bad dog. <laughs> the bad dog. It's like a Frankenstein dog. The Sanderson sisters, it's Oogie Bluey. Boogie. Oh, Bluey! They're nice candy. Oh, do you wanna say Happy Halloween? Happy Halloween. So we just went through, we were looking at the decorations and they were actually trick-or-treating. So they gave you some candy. What else did you get? A Hot Wheels. A Hot Wheels, which one is this? So they gave you... A Dior 3. Oh, a Dior 3. How did you know that, buddy? Wow. Because we, cause, cause we have one orange Dior 3. That is so cool. I gotta show Daddy. He's gonna be so excited for you. Yeah. That's awesome. They were so nice. So this yeah. is from the Surf Up line. How cool. Best Halloween ever, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, now we're going into, I think, two more loops tonight, and then we're probably gonna go to bed. But look at all these inflatables. They have like every single Mickey inflatable. Holy cow, oh, it's a pumpkin patch, an inflatable and pumpkin Minnie. patch. And Minnie, and I love those little ghosties. So cute. Oh, that was a silly trick or treating. Was that silly? Pumpkin. Oh, look at the big ghosts. Wow. 
Oh, spooky. And that big Argo, that's silly. And that one is silly. Why are you not driving so fast? Well, because I wanted to see all the decorations. I love, this is one of the reasons why I absolutely love Fort Wilderness, though, so is like, Fort so people fast. are the best people, I think. Everybody is just so nice, and it's amazing. I love it. I love every part of staying at the fort. Look, this they got an Ursula with moving legs over here. There's like a whole graveyard scene. Spooky. We're gonna have to come in the daytime so we can see it a little bit better. Look then at ooh, scary clown. Back. Oh no, I don't love the clown. Then she came back. <laughs> she came back. Oh, we're talking about Ursula. We're trying to tell the story of Ursula. Look at the spider web. The spooky spider web. Oh, I like the the big guy. Is that Lewis? I think it is. A T spooky guy. Look at that. Oh, look guy. at that big. What is that guy? Kind of like that one. Oh, another another dragon. I wish I wish they were on Oliver's side too, though. Oh, I like that like ogre guy. What is that ogre? Guy? I know it's kind of like Shrek. You don't know who Shrek is yet, I don't think. What's Shrek? Shrek is like an ogre. Whoa! I like the clock. So tomorrow we're gonna do s'mores. I was telling Jackson, I think he's really gonna like it. And he said, yeah, I'm really gonna like it. Because <laughs> I like candy. Because you like candy? Yeah. yeah, it's true. All right, and this is where our night of looping ends. We just did like a little, just, you know, we just went through like a couple of the loops just because Jackson really wanted to see them. But we also had to get back and get him ready for bed because he had school the next day. And Tim went to the party this night. So I am gonna link because he did go live for about an hour from Mickey's Not So Scary this evening and he met some characters and did some trick-or-treating. So I'll link that video down below. He had so much fun. He was like, this is one of the most fun lives that I've ever done. So definitely check that out if you weren't there to see it live, but he had so much fun. We had a really great night. Of course we missed him. So we do go looping with Tim like the next following night. So tune in for some more of that and seeing more Halloween decorations. We met some families that decorated their campsites and they were so excited to like show off all of their inflatables and stuff. It was just like so much fun and meeting people around the loops was a lot of fun. Oh my gosh, I almost forgot to mention the, the merch. Fort Wilderness has some of the absolute best merch in all of Disney World. It is so stinking cute. We wanted to get everything and I'm gonna just give you like a, a bit of a um, spoiler. We didn't buy any of it. We have so many things we just decided we didn't need anything, but oh my gosh, I wanted everything. So if you're at Fort Wilderness, like don't forget to check out the merch because it is amazing. All the food that we had was good. The pizza was, like I said, it wasn't the best thing ever, but it was, it was okay. You know, it did the job. We were full and just staying at the fort is one of our absolute favorite things to do. So I hope you're enjoying this trip as much as we are and tune in tomorrow for, I'm not sure if it's going to be the Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween party video or if it's going to be day three. I'm still kind of deciding which one is going to go up first. So tune in tomorrow for one of those videos. All in all, it was a fantastic day. We had so much fun. So with that being said, we will see you all tomorrow. And now it's time to pay the price.